Okay, this video is a special one for you guys, and um, we're going to be talking about a gas leak. So what happened, we walked into his property, going to fix the boiler, and immediately smelt gas walking into the house. So I looked the customer and said, um, I think you've got a gas leak. This customer was used to the smell of the gas, so he couldn't really tell himself, but I could tell. So we did a, a tightness test on this gas meter here. And we've done our test, but we didn't smell no gas. So, I mean, sorry, there was no pressure drop on the gas. So I thought, that's strange, no pressure drop. It's, we've done let by test, everything was fine, no gas leak. Anyway, I said, right, what we're going to do, we're going to call out Caden because I said, I can smell gas. So we shut the gas off, called them out. They come out. And this is what we've seen, so we're going to go outside and I'll show you. So this is outside, and this is what they did. There's the van. And you can see where the gas was coming from. It's leaking on the other side of the emergency shut-off valve. And hence we didn't detect no gas leak. But because I could smell gas, I didn't take no chances. So this is the result of my vigilance. We told the customer he was very grateful. His house could have blown up because he couldn't smell the gas himself. So if you see a situation like this, you smell gas, I'll take you to do the same thing. But it's good to see this situation where you do get a gas leak on the other side of the meter it's quite rare but it happens you can see here um, they actually bring a new supply in because the previous one must have been obviously that's why the problem was and they've tapped into the main gas supply in the road and brought it in so there you have it See what you think. Give us any comments on what you think. Yeah, it's a good experience uh, as a uh, as a trainer really to go through this situation. Um, yeah, as Coach uh, uh, Tony have said earlier on, yeah, we walk into the property and uh, gas was smelling, but the the tenant can smell, uh, smell gas himself. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it's a new thing for me to really, it's just really that you need, uh, really need to observe and uh, probably, you know, uh, perceive the environment in particularly to see what exactly because uh, we conducted a, a tightness test which proved uh, uh, no drop at all really. So, yeah, but we insisted that uh, there's a situation going on there with the, the gas leak. So, this is the result. Uh, it's a good thing to learn about this really. I really learned particularly about this really. Yeah, yeah, it's a good thing. Okay, cool.